on. Well, cool. I get the big closet. <laughs> That's what you think, girlfriend. <gasps> Lauren. Winnie. <laughs> Give me some. <laughs> how was Italy? More importantly, how was Giuseppe Ferrari? Mm, still doesn't speak a word of English, and girl, I like it that way. <laughs> <laughs> Let me help you with your bag. All right. <clears throat> Winnie, oh. I knew you would find me. Hello. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh. <laughs> oh, my sweet, your feelings for me haven't changed? No, yes, they have. See, I used to despise you, and now I hate you. <laughs> you say hate, but what you really mean is group hug. Oh, oh Christian, <laughs> move your hand or I will break it off. <laughs> Make way, everyone! Lazarini's in the house! Oh, God, look at me, look at me. Oh. Wild guess. You spent the summer in your parents' ice show again. Yeah, it was great. That was a clown who shot out of a cannon. Oh, until I killed Big Bird. Guess who? Ashley! How'd you know it was me? I changed so dramatically. Why? What'd you do? I cut a full quarter inch off my bangs. <laughs> Gutsy move. <laughs> oh, I gotta get down to the track. I flew in this morning and missed my run. Oh, so big deal. So you miss one day. Are you kidding? I pigged out. I had a bag of peanuts on the plane. Oh. <laughs> I know a good way to burn calories. Group <laughs> Hey, has up anyone seen a surfboard around? Group <laughs> So great to see you, man. You haven't changed a bit. Wait a minute. Who are you? I'll tell you if uh, they promise not to hug me again. I see you've met your new roommate, Jackson Green. Good morning, Mr. Elliot, your royal headmasterness, sir. Hello, father. Ashley, what have you done to your hair? Mr. Green joins us from Southern California. I hope you'll make him feel at home. Yeah, we've already hugged. <laughs> Good. Well, I hope to see you at the welcome dance this Saturday. Carry on. Oh, Miss Elliot, we are gonna be there, and I can't wait to bust the move with you. <laughs> no thanks, Winnie. Last year I busted my back just watching you dance. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Hey, How you doing? hey, 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 hey. Since you're a new kid here, let me set you straight. Bobby Lazzarini. I could get your free cable. I could get you day-old cold cuts. I could even get you a fresh mattress. Actually, I could get you anything you want. Great, can you get me out of here? I can't believe this. I mean, my dad gets transferred to Brussels and I get dumped here. I don't mean to intrude, but in case you hadn't noticed, here is Paris. <laughs> it's Babe City, but uh, stay away from Winnie, she's mine. <laughs> Look, guys, you don't understand. I mean, yesterday I had my freedom. I was surfing in California. And today, I'm here stuck in a room with a bunk bed. Look, we all had to get used to living somewhere new. I'm from Brooklyn. And I'm from Germany. Could have never figured that out. <laughs> Look, guys, don't take this personally. I need to be alone, all right? I'm here and I hate Paris. If he leaves, I'll flip you for his mattress. Right. Mm-hmm, girl, I'm telling you, this new guy, he is H-O-T-T -T hot. He almost made me forget Mr. Giuseppe Ferrari. No way. Way. Really, he's that? H-O-T-T -T hot. <laughs> is Giuseppe coming in for the dance? Mm. Well, if he knows what's good for him, girl, I got me a new dress that's gonna make his eyeballs smoke. <laughs> well, I bought a new dress, too, but I don't have anyone to wear it for. Well, what about Jackson Green? Please, I don't know anything about the guy. Girl, what is there to know? He is H-O-T-T -T hot! <laughs> hey, what's the deal here? Do you guys have to wear costumes? Those are our uniforms. Cool, huh? Wait a minute, you guys really wear these? Yeah, chicks love a man in uniform. <laughs> Am I wearing this? Like, I'm calling my old man. Where's the phone? Follow me. It's in there. Who is that? It's Lauren Fontaine. Fontaine sounds French. Uh, excuse me, mademoiselle. 
do awesome, babe. <laughs> Somebody better teach this bozo English. <laughs> Hey, don't you want to call your old man? Why? I love Paris. <laughs> now the smile on the Mona Lisa is an age-old mystery. Can anyone theorize why she is smiling? She just got back from a date with Denzel Washington. <laughs> <laughs> now, Lazzarini, do you have a real answer? No, but uh, I brought you a present. I picked it myself. <laughs> Thank you. Next time, try clippers. It's safer. <laughs> Bonjour, Mr. Dupree. I'm Jackson Green. Haven't you forgotten something, Mr. Green? Why, yes, I have. <laughs> Mr. Green, you're out of uniform. Where I come from, this is the uniform. <laughs> Am I interrupting? Yes, but come in anyway. I just stopped by to welcome you back. How was your vacation? Well, there is no vacation for a headmaster. I'm only comfortable when I'm surrounded by my students and my favorite teachers. I really should get back to my lecture. Of course. Did someone send you flowers? Well, I do have my admirers. Oh. Mr. Green, in case you haven't noticed, surf is not up. Sorry, sir. I don't do uniforms. At the American Academy, we all do uniforms. Well, then I guess we got a problem. I mean, how's anyone going to see my great tan if I got a blazer on? <laughs> Never mind your tan. How can anyone admire my sculptured German physique? <laughs> Winnie, what do you think? I think I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> Wearing uniforms is a 65-year-old tradition at this school. Fine. I'll wear one when I'm 65. Wait right on, come on to the people! Yes. Yeah! Miss oh. Dupre, can't you control your class? Well, it was under control until you came in. Class, please. Mr. Green, you're dressed like everyone else. I'm not sure I can get used to that. I'm sure you can. And to help you get used to it, you can wear your uniform to this weekend's dance. <laughs> In fact, all the students will wear their uniforms to the dance. What? This is not open for discussion. Come on, Ashley, say something to your dad. Yes, Ashley? Uh, I just wanted to say, does the dance start at 8 or 8.15? 8 o'clock. Sharp. I think I know why the Mona Lisa is smiling. Why? Because she knows how stupid we're going to look at the dance. Hi, I just want another chance to say hello, this time in English. Do me a favor. Don't talk to me in any language. Why? Why? Because if it wasn't for you, Mr. Elliot wouldn't have gotten the brilliant idea to make us wear uniforms at the dance. Yeah. And I think I can speak for us all when I say thanks a lot, dude. <laughs> Check it out, a little piece of the US of A. Cool. You know, I'm going to America to play basketball at UCLA. Yeah, of course no one's told UCLA that. <laughs> Just wait, little man, you'll see. I think you like the waitresses here. Especially that one. Definitely that one. <laughs> Since you're our waitress, I guess you'll have to talk to me. Gee, I guess you're right. What do you want? <laughs> Order of fries, please. <laughs> Make it a large, I'll share his. Oh, Winnie, you brought me a present. I'm touched. No, not yet. Now you're touched. <laughs> no, we're just here to return the dresses that we bought for the dance, thanks to Jackson. Hey, I'm really sorry about that. I Don't didn't... Don't worry, it's not your fault. Totally. <laughs> Thanks for bringing this back. No problem. Oh, that was my dream dress. It's just like the one Cindy Crawford wears in the Revlon commercial. 
I love that commercial. I love that dress. I love that girl. <laughs> American Wetball? What's that? What are you up to now? Stick around, you'll see. <laughs> Jackson, you're covering the field with water. I know, that's why they call it Wetball. What do we have to wear? It's uh, come exactly as you are. <laughs> Huh. You're all right. You mean it? Yeah, welcome to USA. <laughs> what is going on here? We were looking for Lazzarini's contact lens. We had contacts. No wonder we didn't find them. <laughs> Maybe I can help, sir. Uh, we got a little carried away before we knew it. <laughs> Look at us. I'm looking. My only regret is that we won't be able to wear these fine uniforms to the dance. Oh, on the contrary, Mr. Green. Those uniforms will look brand new after you and your friends spent all night cleaning them. <laughs> look, guys. Why don't you just go back to your rooms and I'll do the laundry myself, all right? Okay. okay. Wait, you guys, come on. I didn't mean that. It's just a completely bogus gesture on my part. It's laundry time. Yeah. Red dye permanent, no? <laughs> <laughs> Red dye. Permanent. Yup. Yeah. I oh, don't know. I get a bad feeling about this, Jackson. Trust me on this one. It'll work. into a Grateful Dead concert. <laughs> Miss Dupre, you are a deadhead? Absolutely. But I don't think Mr. Elliot was. Miss Dupre, what is going on here? Would you believe 60's Appreciation Day? No, and I don't appreciate it. How did it happen? Well, sir, it was a freak laundry accident. I'm lucky to be alive. It's just... Too bad we won't be able to wear these wonderful uniforms to the dance, right? Right you are, Mr. Green. Because the dance is cancelled. <laughs> Winnie, what's wrong? Giuseppe to tell him that the dance was canceled. What'd he say? Oh, no, he doesn't speak any English, so I think he's still coming. <laughs> Ashley, can't you speak to your father about this? No, no, I can't. Come on. It's no use. Ever since I was a kid, whenever I tried to speak to him, my eyes would well up with tears and I'd run out of the room. Well, I'm all grown up now and he still makes me feel that way. I'm sorry, I just can't do it. What's up, guys? Sensing a little hostility. No, you sensing a lot of hostility. <laughs> you know something, Mr. Cool? Everything at school was just fine before you got here. <sighs> Look, guys, you have no reason to believe anything I'm saying, but believe this. I'm gonna go tell Elliot the truth right now. The truth is not a good idea. He's right. If you do, my dad will expel you. I guess this is goodbye. Come in. Mr. Green, 
What brings you here? The uniform, sir. The whole thing was my fault, so why don't you just kick me out and let the students have their dance? Before I kick anyone out, would you like to tell me why you went to so much trouble? I'm a guy that needs to express himself. I mean, it's important for me to be an individual. Stand up from the crowd. I, mean, I think I speak for my entire generation. It's a I... girl, isn't it? <laughs> You're very perceptive. May I sit down? It's not my daughter, is it? No. Have a seat. <laughs> you know, when I was your age, it was a girl named Hillary. She had flaxen hair and she rode side saddle. But that's for another time. <laughs> Jackson, this is about all of us. Yeah, sure, it was his idea to play wet ball, but we all played. I scored eight touchdowns and three extra points. I was MVP. Oh, will you shut up? And we all chose to wear the tie-dyed uniform. So you're all sticking together? Yes. 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 Your sovereign headmastership. If you expel Jackson Green, you're gonna have to expel all of us. Hmm. You know, expelling each of you is the right way to handle this, but then, again, I don't have to always do the right thing. Your friend Jackson here has convinced me. I'm not expelling anyone. The dance is back on, and you can wear whatever you like. Yeah. You're the man, your head highness. Father, don't try to stop me. I'm not a little girl anymore. I've got a map, and I'm going to use it. The uniforms are stupid. Everyone hates them, and all Jackson Green tried to do was stick up for us. So if you expel him, you might as well expel me too. Now about the dance. The dance is back on. The uniforms have been abolished, and Jackson's not expelled. <laughs> well, I'm good. <laughs> now about my allowance. Don't push it. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Oh, Jackson, now. Um, yeah? Even though you're not expelled, you're on restriction. You will not be attending our dance. Yes, sir. Oh, and by the way, when I was a student here, I didn't like the uniforms either. And I used a lot more red dye. <laughs> Well, I would love to hang with all of you, but I have a Ferrari to jump start. <laughs> Giuseppe Ferrari. <laughs> Winnie, stop. You can still change your mind. You can go with me. What do you say? I say, um, arrivederci. <laughs> arrivederci? Does that mean I love you in Italian? <laughs> Close enough. Winnie! Arrivederci! Winnie! Well, come on, Ashley. Let's get to the dance for the cocktail weenies are gone. <laughs> My favorite. <laughs> What's the matter? Am I overdressed? No. You're not over... You're not under. You're perfect. Thanks. It's very sweet. It's just a, a shame you gotta go all alone. Alone? I'm not going alone. Ah, uh, bonsoir, Lauren. Hi, Pierre. Pierre? There's a Pierre? He's my date. You knew I had a date, didn't you? Oh, yeah, sure. Of course I knew that. A date, absolutely. Pierre, I'll be downstairs in a minute. Jackson? Yeah? I just wanted to say thank you for the uniform thing. Well, I did it for everyone. I know, and I just wanted to say that I'm... I mean, we're glad you're here. Thanks. Well, good night, I guess. Yeah, good night, I guess. Lauren? Yes, Jackson? <laughs> Have a good time. Thanks. <sighs> but not too good of a time. <laughs>